Hi guys, I'm Ergie and welcome to my channel. So today I wanted to make a video about um, the Kat Von D Everlasting Liquid Lipsticks. And this is in the shade Lolita and this is the shade that everyone's been dying to have. Um, they're never in stock on Sephora and I mean it took me forever just to get my hands on it and they're always out even if you go to Sephora and on their Sephora online stores. So it's been really hard trying to get it, but finally got it and I'm so happy and I love it. So this is for the people that want the new one, um, the new formula that is. Because everyone knows that um, they changed it and a lot of people were complaining about not liking the new formula or the new, like the shade is different, it's like darker, more brown, purpley. But um, for my skin tone, for women of color in general, I feel like this is the perfect nude. It's like brownish pink and it just, I mean, it just compliments you. It's not like too ugly and too bright on you and doesn't wash you out. So that's why I like it. Um, but yeah, it's been really hard to try to get a dupe for this. Um, I pretty much looked everywhere before I, because I couldn't get my hands on this at first. So I was trying to get like dupes, but I couldn't find any dupes online or blogs or YouTube. So I just, you know, ventured out and I said, okay, well, I'm going to try to find the dupe. So a lot of you might not like this, but the first dupe I have is actually a lip liner. Um, I'm the type of person who wears lip liners as lipsticks anyway, because they're just so matte and creamy. I don't know. So this is in the, this is Essence. It's by Essence and it's, it's a really, really cheap brand. Um, I found this at Ulta and it was only $1.99. And this is in the color Soft Berry 05. And that's how that looks. And it's just a really, really, really pretty color. And I'm gonna just, first I'm gonna swatch all of these on my hand and then I'm gonna um, swatch it on my lip. So it can be kind of like easier to look at. Actually, I'm sorry. Let me show you how Lolita looks. I'm actually wearing Lolita right now on my lip. It's really matte and it's really long lasting and I love it. So I'm so glad I could finally get my hands on it. So the top one is Lolita and then the second one is Soft Berry, the Essence Lip Liner. And on camera, it, it kind of, I mean, you can tell they're different shades, but they're very, very similar on the lip. Um, and the Kat Von D, it kind of takes a um, more time to dry so it kind of looks light for now but as it dries it gets like more brownie nudey so right now it looks kind of pinkish but it gets kind of darker so so far this is the number one dupe that i found it, it's like the best match and it goes on matte so usually when i wear this it stay it stays on the whole day i actually discovered this before um before i got the kat von d and then I compared it and then I realized that it really looks similar so that's how that looks um, and it's really long lasting both of them are long lasting it works just as well as the Kat Von D and yeah so if you're looking for the Kat Von D shade in Lolita I would definitely recommend to get this if you can't get your hands on it until then you can get this it's only $1.99 the Kat Von D is like $20 so this is much better to get and then the second one that looks most like it is my Wet n Wild Mega Last Lipsticks and this is in the color Mocha Licious 914C and it looks kind of ugly but that's how that looks and this does come off matte but it's still not as matte it's, it's not quite as matte as um, the Kat Von D and the lip liner I just showed you so I'm just going to swatch that next to them and the very third one is the Wet n Wild Mocha Licious. That's how that looks. And it's, it's a really nice neutral brown nudish color for people of my skin tone. So it's really nice. Um, this is only, I think, $1.99. And you can find this at CVS, Rite Aid, Walgreens, your drugstore. Sometimes you can find out some Walmarts and it just kind of depends because some Walmarts don't have the Wet n Wild brand but or you can just find it on Amazon online or eBay whatever you want. So this is also actually pretty long lasting. Um, I feel like it's actually softer on my lips. It doesn't dry out as much so that's also a plus. And okay and then the second one would be 
this is another eyeliner uh, I mean not eyeliner lip liner and it, it was only like a dollar at the beauty supply store you can find this brand um, what is it called J J cats I, like it has like this type of logo and you can see like they do kind of look alike when you when you compare all of these colors like they're really really similar so this is J cars J cats and it's called the color is T rose and I'm just also gonna swatch that for you guys and I would say if you're the type of person that's looking for the old Lolita the lighter pink one that everyone wants back I would say get this until that until Kat Von D brings that back because it's not as brown it's more dusty pink than the rest of the shades but they are very similar like see it's a lot lighter and this is the first time I'm doing a swatch video so you'll have to excuse me I'm not really that good at it yet but but hopefully you saw you can see like I'm getting my point across I don't know and you'll have to excuse my nails I haven't didn't get it done this week haven't had time so okay and then um I would have to say next uh these elf matte lip color type lipsticks um they're really matte you can find it from elf I think I got this from Marshalls at for two I think it was two it was like 230 something I don't know it's about three dollars it's lower than three dollars anyway if you get it at Marshalls but it's usually three dollars on elf on the elf site so and then it's like a really matte color and it kind of goes up like this and I'm also gonna swatch that for you guys and this is also a lighter pink it's not as dark as the Lolita but it could be very similar to the to the Lolita that they discontinued the old one that's that everyone was complaining about okay so the elf one swatched looks like this it's the very very last one and it's pretty similar to the J Cats one that I just showed you guys. And so, obviously the Kat Von D is darker, but for those people that bought the new Kat Von D and you hate it for like lighter skin tones or like Caucasians, um, I would say if you want, if, like if you're still looking for the old one and you can't find it anywhere, I would say purchase this color because it's just so light. But it still has that dusty pink look and then these two they're not exactly dupes but I just kind of wanted to mention it because um, I don't know they they're they dry off matte just like the Kat Von D lipsticks and I'm just gonna swatch them for you guys so you can know what I'm talking about and this is the NYX um, soft matte lip colors um, lip creams this is how it looks and I'm just gonna swatch that side by side and this is more pinky like it's like a pinkish tone but it's still like a settled down pink so anyone could barely wear it could ba basically wear it barely wear it okay and so this is the NYX um, matte pencils and it's still that like toned down dusty pink look so I would still say if you can't find the old formula get that and this is only I think six dollars um, I found mine's at the beauty supply store but you can also find this at Ulta as well and I think it's like six seven dollars around there but it's pretty cheap especially compared to Kat Von D and then the last one is wet n wild mega last liquid lipsticks and this lipstick it's kind of Usually people have um, a hate and love and hate relationship with this lipstick because it it stays on the whole day no matter what you do no matter what like what things you use it just doesn't get off of your lips it's very like it's kind of tricky but um, I would say if you do decide to purchase this um, use olive oil or any type of oil put some tissue um, put the olive oil on the tissue and then just rub it off and then it it comes off so that's how I do it 
but yeah it doesn't come off so that's the good part of it the good and bad part of it and it kind of looks like Lolita but not really it's more pink so I'm also gonna swatch that and at the end I'm gonna um, I'm gonna try to provide like a picture since I don't know it's kind of sloppy right now the way I'm doing it so I'm just gonna provide a picture and tell you guys like which is which unless in case you guys get confused okay so it's the very very last one and I've been doing this diagonally I've never known just how hard it is to do swatches it's not hard but like I don't know it's a little tricky but yeah it's the very very last one and that's wet and wilds um, it's called pitched wine or something like that high pitched wine that's what it's called and once again you can find the CVS Walgreens Amazon or some Walmarts and so I'm gonna do my next um, my swatch my swat my lip swatches so you guys can see how it looks on my lip and just how similar they are and um, so yeah thanks for watching and hopefully you enjoyed this video bye